Happiness is the meaning and the purpose of life, the whole aim and end of human existence. A friend to all is a friend to none. Happiness depends upon ourselves. Hope is a waking dream. Knowing yourself is the beginning of all wisdom. Educating the mind without educating the heart is no education at all. No great mind has ever existed without a touch of madness. Patience is bitter, but its fruit is sweet. To perceive is to suffer. Those who know, do. Those that understand, teach. He who has overcome his fears will truly be free. Poverty is the parent of revolution and crime. Pleasure in their job puts perfection in the work. To write well, express yourself like the common people, but think like a wise man. Learning is not child's play. We cannot learn without pain. In all things of nature, there is something of the marvelous. The end of labor is to gain leisure. You will never do anything in this world without courage. It is the greatest quality of the mind next to honor. Quality is not an act, it is a habit. Character is determined by choice, not opinion. Our characters are the result of our conduct. All human actions have one or more of these seven causes. Chance, nature, compulsions, habit, reason, passion, desire. All human beings, by nature, desire to know. Change in all things is sweet. Criticism is something we can avoid easily by saying nothing, doing nothing, and being nothing. Dignity does not consist in possessing honors, but in deserving them. Each man judges well the things he knows. For what is the best choice for each individual is the highest it is possible for him to achieve. Good habits formed at youth make all the difference. Happiness is an expression of the soul in considered actions. He who has never learned to obey cannot be a good commander. It is during our darkest moments that we must focus to see the light. The actuality of thought is life. The proof that you know something is that you are able to teach it. Courage is the first of human qualities because it is the quality which guarantees the others. We are what we frequently do. 
It is our choice of good or evil that determines our character, not our opinion about good or evil. Character may almost be called the most effective means of persuasion. Character is made by many acts. It may be lost by a single one. We can do noble acts without ruling the earth and sea. The best friend is the man who, when wishing me well, wishes it for my sake. We are what we repeatedly do. Excellence, then, is not an act, but a habit. The worst form of inequality is to try to make unequal things equal. The aim of the wise is to not secure pleasure, but to avoid pain. Friendship is a single soul dwelling in two bodies. It is possible to fail in many ways, while to succeed is possible only in one way. It is not enough to win a war, it is more important to organize the peace. Nature does nothing in vain. Life is a gift of nature, but beautiful living is the gift of wisdom. The quality of life is determined by its activities. A likely impossibility is always preferable to an unconvincing possibility. All men by nature desire knowledge. Anybody can become angry that is easy, but to be angry with the right person, and to the right degree and at the right time, and for the right purpose, and in the right way that is not within everybody's power, and is not easy. At his best, man is the noblest of all animals. Separated from law and justice, he is the worst. Democracy is when the indigent, and not the men of property, are the rulers. Equality consists in the same treatment of similar persons. Every rascal is not a thief, but every thief is a rascal. Excellence is never an accident. It is always the result of high intention, sincere effort, and intelligent execution. It represents the wise choice of many alternatives. Choice, not chance, determines your destiny. Fear is pain arising from the anticipation of evil. Happiness is activity. He who is to be a good ruler must have first been ruled. It is easy to perform a good action, but not easy to acquire a settled habit of performing such actions. Liars, when they speak the truth, are not believed. Men acquire particular quality by constantly acting in a particular way. Misfortune shows those who are not really friends. Most people would rather give than get affection. The happy life is regarded as a life in conformity with virtue. It is a life which involves effort and is not spent in amusement. 
The ultimate value of life depends upon awareness and the power of contemplation rather than upon mere survival. To love someone is to identify with them. Wishing to be friends is quick work, but friendship is a slow ripening fruit 